uh, two students are, are having an argument that in a family of say three children the probability of having two girls is more than the probability of having two boys okay so this is the argument uh, three children family so they're talking about three children family okay so now let's first think about a three child family and all only in terms of girls okay so we're talking in terms of girls so in how many possible ways are going to get this family so well you can get zero girl that means all the three are boys you can get one girl and two boys you can get two girls and one boy or you get all the three girls okay so now the argument is that the probability the probability of uh, girls of two girls is greater is greater than the probability of one girl we are talking in terms of uh, uh, number of girls so now we're going to do an experiment so there is a way in which you can find a theoretical probability but let's do an experiment to see which has more probability or they have equal probability or whether this is greater or this is greater okay so what I've done is I made a table so I have this is a family number the first family I'm going to generate random numbers now what I'm what do I mean by random number suppose when you generate random numbers so let me show you random numbers on my calculator so so if you press this is a random number and if you press equal these are the random numbers so if you press equal you get random numbers okay so let me uh, do it again random number equal so you're going to get the number can be either odd or even so we're going to look at only the first three numbers so we're going to we have to decide something before that so if we get say if the numbers are 0 2 4 6 or 8 they are even we are going to say they are girls okay and if it is 1 3 5 7 or 9 1 3 5 7 or 9 these are only ways in which you're going to get the digits so you're going to say that's a boy okay so if it's odd you say boy if it's even it is girl so let us generate the random numbers so the first number first three numbers that i we are only looking at the first three numbers so it's four four eight so first thing that i'll do is i'll write numbers four four eight first let me write the numbers okay so the next number is nine eight two nine eight two okay the next number next two num nine uh two eight two two eight two i'll explain what these numbers mean the next number is was eight five four eight five four and the last number was okay the next number was nine six one so what have we decided if we if you're getting an even so you're looking at even or odd so all the three are even even means all the three are girls so we can say girl 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 so odd means boy so nine is an odd so it's boy girl girl all the three are even that is girl 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 and this is even so it is girl next is odd so it is boy the next is even it is girl nine is e odd nine is odd so it is boy six is girl and one is boy so here there are how many girls we're only thinking about girls so this is three girls this is two girls this is three girls this is two girls and this is one girl okay so let me remove the veil i have done an experiment of how many families i've done an experiment of 30 families so six to nine that is girl even these are even even odd so girl girl boy so we want to find the probability of getting two girls so let's answer that question if with, based on this on these 30 families what can we say what's the probability of 
two girls. Okay, so let's count all the twos. Okay, all the twos. So this is a two, one, two, three, uh, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, and twelve. So the probability of getting two girls out of thirty families is twelve out of thirty. I hope I counted it right. Now, what's the probability of getting one girl? So let's count the families with one girls. So let me use a cross. So this is one girl. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and 10. Okay, so it's 10 out of 30. This is 10 out of 30. Okay, so you can simplify this is one third. And you can divide both by four. So this is divide by four. Oh, sorry, you can't divide by four, both of them. So you can divide by two. Okay, so this is divide by two, divide by two. So here yeah, this simplifies to six out of sorry, six out of 15. Or you can leave the answer as it is. So this is 12 out of 30, and this is 1 out of 10 out of 30.